Hello friends, as we have completed with our video 1, that is introduction to inheritance, now we will start with our inheritance type single inheritance. As we know single inheritance in this type inheritance derived class inherit from a single base class. In a single inheritance derived class can be directly access the public and protected member of the base class. Implement an is a relationship. Example consider a class person which have data as a name and age, class employee which have a data as salary. Person can become a base class for an employee to access data, name and age of the employee. In this example, you can see there are two classes are available. First is father and then the child. In the above example, in the given example, base class is a father and the child class is nothing but the derived class from the base class. So child is accessing all the features of base class father. Now we can see the general syntax of single inheritance. As we created class A as a base class and over here class B is a derived class from a base class where we put a visibility of public so that all the member function of class A could be get access easily into class B that is a derived class. In the given program, we are explaining how the single inheritance will work. Right now, a class, a base class we have created is a student class student. The member functions are role number, int role number, character name. We created it as a public and public function and in the get method we are receiving the value that is role number and the name in void show method we are going we are receiving the value we are getting the value role number and the name in get this is the derived class class result and the student is a base class which is providing public as the visibility mode so all the member function of the main base class could be get access easily into the derived class we have declared the member function as a int marks again we have declared it as a public function and we are getting accessing the value C out enter marks C in marks over here we will asking user to enter marks and that marks will be get accessed into the get function get one function over here void show one C out marks and marks that is we are accessing or displaying the marks which is entered by the user using show one method function. Now we have created a new method, uh, a new main function which provided with the object r that is our base class result r and we are getting individual value object dot get, object dot get one, object dot show, object dot show one and get ch individual value as we can see get to get method it is basically used for receiving the value from the user that is roll number void show method it will help you to display the roll number and the name get one method is function is basically used to enter 
marks by the user it will be get accepted over here and show one method is used for entering the marks which will be displayed onto the screen so this is one of the example of single level inheritance which will provide you the values or the features from the base class towards the derived class thank you in next video we are going to see multi level inheritance